Hi, my name is Shaira Luna. Hi, I'm Koji Arboleda. Hi, I'm Irwin Canlas. I'm Miguel Alamahan. I'm Andrea Bildua. I'm Magic Luanag. I'm a photographer. It's pretty hard for me to describe my aesthetic in a single word or sentence. So I'd say it's not very technical and it's very nostalgic. Moody, more cinematic. Minimal. And I like it very clean. But the humor is part of my aesthetic. I like it all natural. The geometry and art. Very youthful and weird. <laughs> I started out photographing gigs and events and shooting a lot of bands. I started shooting concerts. I got into an internship to a magazine. I have this friend. May online shop siya na gusto niya mag magbenta sa Multiply. We just started shooting. Photographer was the last thing that really crossed my mind. I had considered everything before being a musician, a researcher, a writer, an astronaut, a, a ballerina, but never a photographer. I really wanted to be a civil engineer. I wanted to become a pilot. I also wanted to become a vet. <laughs> it just, you know, it just fell into place. Oh, what do you do, Io? I'm a photographer. But what do you actually do? Uh, I'm here to explain. Oh, those billboards. Like, I shoot stuff like that. Depends who you're talking to. Go around the venue. You know, check places where I can shoot. Just making sure I know where the location is, who I'm shooting. Details, every tiny detail is important. Eh? You, you set up your lights, your equipment. Usually, yun yung pinaka mahirap kasi bibit bitin mo from the car, sobrang dami mong dala. being able to express herself. Because I'm a frustrated writer. I'm very visual. It's a great outlet for people like me who just can't stop imagining and creating. The power to create. You meet these interesting people that you thought you could never talk to. You get to talk to these artists. You start the day excited, you end the day excited. So that's what matters. Patience. Patience. If you want something, you work hard. If you want something more, you work harder. Grit eh. You have to suck it up. Hindi pwede maging diva. Okay, relax lang tayo. I don't really panic. You have to think on your feet. You have to go against the wave. Like, hindi ka dapat magpakain sa situation. So I was making him throw these, like, plants in the air. That's and then like the next layout was he was eating a watermelon. It was so weird because I was directing him eating a watermelon. I was like, "Sige, parang kagati mo siya ng parang primal." Pero it was just so funny because he was so into it. The client asked if I can take a photo of Pia on her float. Honestly, with the sea of people, I had to get through them up until I got to her float. We were beside Pia's float. And I was shouting on the top of my lungs, Pia, look here! Pia, look here! Mrs. Araneta, they were like, get down. <laughs> get down from there. It really depends on what client you're getting. If okay yung client, okay yung pay. I think being a photographer pays well naman. When it comes to some projects, it really varies per project. It's not the amount, it's the experience and self-fulfillment. You really have to find your light. Find your own light in a sense na you have to develop your personality, your aesthetic, your character as a photographer, and also your professionalism towards your clients and your team. You're an artist. It's not just you show up to a job and then you click some buttons and then you're done. It's not, eh. You have to live and breathe art. You can never be a success overnight. It would really be better if you just kept shooting and shooting first without really trying to fit yourself into a category, the easier it will be to really find that style when the time is right.